We don't need any more activists in the world that have started, you know, with great intentions and then become bitter, frustrated, cynical. Like we have enough of that. And we also know that culture, creativity, and innovation have always been key to effective change. And it's been true historically, it's true today. But finding the information that you needed in order to be effective at that, for me, was very difficult. It's spread out all over the place. A lot of people are self-taught. If you're good at it, it's because you're either really persistent at seeking out that information or you get kind of lucky and it's all built on hunches. That's not how this practice should be, right? The practice of artistic activism. It shouldn't be a folk art, right? You should be able to access that information. So that's why one of the reasons Steve Duncombe and I wrote The Art of Activism, uh, which is our book that takes the lessons that we learned through all our research and then have been teaching around the world But the other problem was that if you wanted to take a workshop with us, it was kind of impossible uh, because we would do them in all different parts of the world. We would work with organizations. And if you weren't in that part of the world or part of that organization, there really wasn't an easy way for you to get access. Right. So that has always been frustrating for us. And that's why in 2022, we set up the learning labs. And Learning Labs is a program we created at the Center for Artistic Activism to give people a place that they could, uh, an entryway, right? Anyone from around the world could sign up for a Learning Lab and they could get the book and, and do the book like a workshop, two chapters a week for six weeks with other people and with Center for Artistic Activism trainers in order to um, share that experience to learn from other people who are in different parts of the world and and struggling with different problems and seeing how they were approaching it and to have the access to the kind of resources that we could offer. And we did, I don't know, a dozen of these workshops over the last year, uh, over six week periods, all online, people joining from around the world and brought all these alumni through that program that have been asking for access to Center for Artistic Activism training for years. The trainers that we got too are incredible. The Learning Labs is one of the programs at the Center for Artistic Activism that I am most proud of. Uh, And I'm really hopeful that in 2023, we can bring more people who are motivated and curious and want to improve the effectiveness of their artistic activism in the world and be able to give them this door, like to keep that door open for them and that opportunity there so that they can, um, they can benefit from all the research and expertise that we have on our team.